Welcome to Digital Champions TV, where we explore the dynamic landscape of advertising and marketing. I'm Greg Kirkham, and today we're joined by Steve Rustad, the owner of Rustad Marketing, a brand development and marketing communications consultancy based in Petaluma, California. Welcome, Steve. It's a pleasure having you. Hey, Greg. Thanks for having me over. Now, you began your career as an art director for Botsford Ketchum in San Francisco. How did, did. your early way experiences... Back when. <laughs> yeah, way back when. Well, I mean, um, how did well, your that was, experiences that was, help shape uh, your approach to brand development? Uh, advertising basics haven't changed since people started understanding what brands were. Uh, even though things are digital now and they, they were very analog back then, the principles are still uh, important. Uh, brand persona, uh, is what some people call goodwill, is the most important aspect of a company that a company can have. And uh, uh, that's, you know, that's been the case since forever. So keeping in mind the basic principles of why a brand works, what what brand loyalty really is, it's not just symbols and a logo and a color scheme it's really how you interact with the people and how they they learn to trust you and their experience with your product and service yeah and you mentioned differentiation as a significant change in marketing uh, when when you scroll say if somebody goes on facebook or anything like that it all looks the same all the ads tend to look the same they blend together um, but with a differentiated approach, like with uh, Restad Marketing, you're really changing the game in many ways. Um, tell well, us a little bit about that. Back in the beginning, if you advertised on television, that was all you needed to do. But as the market grew and more people joined on, differentiation became much more important. And differentiation is basically not just saying the same thing or looking like the, the, your competition. What can you do to make yourself stand out? You know, some people look have have uh, spokes spokespersons uh, that work. Some people have uh, a kind of a change in attitude. Uh, some people feature uh, uh, unique experiences that their that their brand uh, that their brand allows. Uh, and this is a problem when when say for example, the experience with an automobile is pretty much the same across all brands. Uh, breakfast food. Uh, uh, soft drink. So how do you quickly in social media create a post that um, or Facebook or Instagram uh, that immediately jumps out as you? And that, that can be with graphics. It can be with the style of messaging. One of my favorite uh, Instagram accounts right now is the National Park Service. Great attitude, uh, very funny and useful information. Now, they don't have a lot of competition, but I would encourage anyone if they want to look at tips on differentiation to look at the National Park Service Instagram account. <laughs> yeah, it seems like there has been an evolution uh, that's taken place in marketing uh, when, you know, a lot of a lot of companies have taken the exact same identical approach. They've kind of cannibalized a lot of the messaging where you with rest of marketing, you establish the differentiation. You help people be able to find their voice in many ways. Um, yeah, oh, yeah. Now, brand you, voice. Go ahead. Oh no, I was brand just voice. Say, what benefits? So I'm, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm talking over you. Say again. You're okay. I was just going to say, what benefits do you believe an agency like Rustad Marketing provides, particularly in terms of objectivity and broader brand vision? Well. I'm constantly dealing with this phenomenon I call being a legend within your own walls. So what I try to do is to get brands to understand what, what is it about them that is unique or can be made to be seen as unique. Uh, just listening to yourself, what they call in politics, the echo chamber <clears throat> doesn't help. You know, I always say uh, it isn't what you say, it's what they hear. And you got to You really do need to pay attention to your competition because you do not want to look like you just took what they did and ran it through a copy machine. Uh, and again, there's there, there's impotence to do that because stuff is well produced. But you can always find something, some advantage in in your company to exploit, to use, to emphasize, to make yourself look different. 
And that's Wonderful. part of my job. It's part of that, that that's part of being objective and why having an outside consultant who can be objective, um, you really need on your side because it does help you I would say find the truth or find the find the interest. Wonderful. Yeah. Thank you, Steve, for sharing your expertise and insights with us today. To connect with Steve Rustad and learn more about Rustad Marketing, visit digitalchampionstv.com. We're working with agencies to be able to scale them and grow them and provide them services that would cost them way more than it would uh, for them to do it themselves. As as an agency owner, you need the support of other people to really be able to serve your clients better and be able to provide them with services that they're going to not only want to purchase for the first time, but they're going to want to continue purchasing over the long haul. So it includes anything from video production all the way to web design, SEO, video content, and then also uh, lead generation, social media, the works. What we do is we take a, a hands-on approach with our clientele to be able to help help you be successful, help you grow, help you really dial in who you are as an agency, and help you focus more on those core values that you want within your business. We're not just a, you know, a white label agency, we're a consultancy. And because we have scaled multiple agencies, uh, <laughs> we've worked with hundreds of clients, we know what it takes to be able to, to grow the business.